Today we will learn drawing solid shapes on a flat surface. Two figures are shown here. Can you tell which shape is two dimensional and which is three dimensional? Think, think. Just try it. Here, this shape is two dimensional and this is three dimensional. Here, both the figures are drawn on the same flat surface. Yet, we can easily tell which shapes are two dimensional and which are three dimensional. Can you explain why? Think, think. The reason is the art of drawing them. When a solid shape is shown on a flat surface. The faces drawn are slightly distorted which shows the shape as a 3D figure. In this way we can draw any 3 dimensional figure on a 2 dimensional plane like on a paper. We call this the 2D representation of a 3D solid figure. Would you like to know how it is done? In this video, we will learn two techniques with the help of which we can make a 2D shape representation of a 3D solid figure. One of these techniques is oblique sketch and the other technique is isometric sketch. Let us first understand what is the difference between them. Here the cube with 4 cm edge is drawn with both these techniques in oblique sketch and isometric sketch. But there is some difference between the two. Can you tell what is that difference? Think, think. Exactly. The length of sides drawn in the three-dimensional shape by the technique of oblique sketch are not in same proportion. But we still know important information about solid shape. As here, all the three edges seem equal. But in reality, their lengths are not in same proportion. In the picture drawn using the isometric sketch, we see that the length of sides are kept in same proportion. For example, here, the lengths of three edges are proportional. A proportionate drawing is drawn on isometric dot sheet. Now let's learn how to draw them. Suppose we have to draw an oblique sketch of the cube by taking length of the edge as 4 unit. For this we will use a square paper. Step 1. First of all, we will draw the front face of the cube as a square of side 4 units on the squared paper. Step 2. Now we will draw the face opposite to the front face of the cube. We will draw this face in such a way that its measurement is equal to the front square face but it is slightly slipped compared to the front square face. Step 3. After this, we will join the corresponding corners of the two squared faces. Step 4. Now, we will show the hidden edges with a dotted line. This is a convention that we follow. Thus, we have drawn an oblique sketch of a cube of dimensions 4 by 4 by 4 units. Now, let us draw the isometric sketch of this. We use dotted isometric sheets to draw isometric sketch. With the help of this sheet, we will draw isometric sketch. Step 1. First of all, we will draw a square of 4 by 4 unit of edges to show the front face. Step 2. Draw 4 line segments of 4 unit length from the four corners of the square in this way. 
Step 3. Now we will join the end points of the line segments in such a way that we get the back face of the figure exactly the same as its front face. Step 4. Now we will show the hidden edges with a dotted line. In this way we have drawn a proportionate 2D representation of the cube. We will get to know it better in the next video. Today we learned how to draw solid shapes on a flat surface. We will see some examples related to them in the next video. 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 Video.